Now, Cap Cave View First Alert Weather with Jason Valentine. Fog hat. I hope they play Slow Ride. That's their big hit. All right, good Friday evening, everybody. Welcome to the weekend. Warmer weekend ahead. Air quality improving, but there's a catch. Not improving in Yakima. Winds light tomorrow, and they look to be light for our weekend. So take a look at our temperature trend. We are well below average, safe for Sunday, even as we head into our next work week. Average for this time of year is 88. So as we, uh, in the, at least in Kennewick, when they take the kids to school, it'll be 80 degrees. So a nice day, just not too warm on Wednesday, which of course is September 1st. So cooler temperatures by a touch than last night. 82 in the Tri-Cities, 77 for Yakima and Toppenish. They're still dealing with quite a bit of haze. So that's kind of blunting the sunshine a little bit and a little bit cooler along the blues. Already 69 in Dayton, my goodness. So we have seen some wind kicking up today. We did expect between 10 and 20 mile per hour winds. Not too much wind in the mid-Columbia, at least the Tri-Cities at 9, but kind of few double digits and then 20 miles per hour in Yakima, or Toppenish, excuse me, in Yakima. So taking a look at our smoke forecast, look at what's going to happen overnight. More of it is going to be spreading throughout pretty much to the south, but into the Tri-Cities to tomorrow morning and more into Yakima. Folks, this smoke is not going anywhere until they take care of that Schneider Springs fire. We do look forward to having some winds coming from or coming from the south up or from the north down. But right now we're seeing quite a bit of winds from the southwest and the northwest. So that means more smoke is on the way. So future cast, besides that, we're seeing mostly clear skies to just plain old sunshine as we head into our weekend. Uh, no precipitation. So if you're doing some traveling over the pass, it should be very comfortable, even though uh, except for traffic. All right, overnight tonight, mid to lower 50s, some upper 40s as we continue to cool down overnight. As we head into our Saturday, our weekend proper, look at this. Plenty of sunshine, though. Do expect more haze in the Yakima Valley area. Mid to lower 80s. Again, very close closely together highs. That means we're in a stable weather pattern. As we head into Sunday, that's going to be our hot spot. 89 for the Tri-Cities. It's a winning slot machine, Alyssa. All suns throughout. Fantastic. Down to 78 on Tuesday, and they're kind of leveling out in the lower 80s as we get to our next weekend. In the Yakima, 88 on Sunday. Maybe a hint of clouds here and there. But folks, we look at a beautiful weekend ahead. We just hope there isn't as much smoke as there is today in the Yakima Valley.